With your weatherbug.com severe weather outlook, I'm meteorologist Gretchen Mischik. Portions of the upper Midwest once again dealing with severe weather and heavy rain. It's an area that has been inundated with uh, areas of showers and torrential downpours leading to record rainfall in places like Minneapolis, Minnesota. Rainfall totals in excess of four inches yesterday made it the fifth wettest day on record since 1871, the wettest day was June 23rd, so right around the corner. That was 1987 with a whopping 9.15 inches of rain. We've also been dealing with a tremendous amount of moisture as we've started the day today down in Del Rio, Texas. So far this year, we've only had 1.71 inches of rain, but just since midnight, we've picked up over four inches of rain. So we definitely needed the rain. We've been below average, but of course, when it comes all at once, that's when you do have some flash flooding concerns. So we have had some flash flood warnings in effect down towards Del Rio. A front comes sweeping across the Ohio River Valley for today. Then uh, we may see some stronger storms firing across portions of central and northern Minnesota. Our attention will be turning towards Saturday, though, with a more widespread outlook for severe weather, which will include portions of the central plains and into the upper Midwest. Let's take a closer look at those zones of concern for today. A widespread general thunderstorm threat, which includes much of the central and eastern U.S., a small zone of concern in northern and central Minnesota. But for tomorrow, we'll be honing in on the central and northern plains, which include much of Nebraska and into South Dakota, the southern portions of Iowa, northern portions of Missouri, as well as the western portion of Illinois. That is going to be where we may see some strong to severe storms as we head through the afternoon. We'll keep you posted with all the details. Check back to Weatherbug for the latest.